Good morning, Simon. I'm standing in front of Willow Tree, a third generation shop here in Wyandotte that has clothing, accessories, purses, bags, a, a lot of incredible things. And now it also has art in the windows. And we're going to be walking around. This is Jeremy. Uh, we are social distance interviewing Hello, here. Jeremy is the co-owner of Rivers Edge Gallery. And I, uh, Brian, and my photojournalist, you can probably come in a little bit. And Jeremy, tell me about this piece of art that we're looking at this in the window. There. Piece by Mr. Tim Payway from Hortonville, Michigan, and it's all found wood. Uh, and this is actually called the Ornithology Enthusiast, and it's an actual birdhouse that you can take the hat off, you can move with binoculars. But if you look at that belly button, you can't see it right now, but you look right inside, there's actually a bird's nest, and to the rear of that piece, uh, there's a door where the bird's nest, uh, you, you can remove the bird's nest or check oh, on it you, or add food. You can see the door right there, yeah. just behind. Yeah. Oh, and very neat. And that's all carved, hand carved, I'm it's assuming. It's all hand carved, yep. It's a really neat. real folk art inspired piece. Yep, and that artist, he's local? Uh, Hortonville, Michigan, yep. Hortonville, Michigan, not far at all. Okay, then we've got more art, of course, you can see in the window displays, purses and bags and coats, cool umbrellas, uh, beautiful displays that Willow Tree has, and now they've got even more to admire. Here is more of your art, and I love there's such a variety of mediums. Tell me a little bit about what we're looking at here. Well, well on, the, on the floor here, they gave me the floor space, so what better to use it for sculpture. So I have some Sean Stachel work. I have a sturgeon, which is synonymous with, uh, with the Detroit River. We've got the adapter fish made out of recycled wood. And then we have these two sweet little animal, four-legged animal so guys. Sweet. They're made in the same way you'd make a surfboard, the same process. Oh. And then on the wall, if you notice, there's uh, two Patricia Izzos. Probably hi hard to see with the glare, but uh, Patricia is a fantastic artist. Uh, those are multimedia, mixed media uh, pieces. Uh, and uh, they're, you know, they're of dresses. <laughs> uh, but, you know, there's a little more deeper message, but uh, just certainly fitting. Great. I tried to curate it to fit. Awesome. I love that. So this is at Willow Tree. We saw Total Health Foods. We saw uh, a menswear shop. We saw earlier this morning Salon Misha. a salon, Salon Misha. Your gallery is there. So there's uh, close to 10 businesses, mostly along Biddle Avenue here in downtown Wyandotte, Sima. And Jennifer, Ann, remind us again one more time if folks who are walking along see something they like, how can they get a hold of that art piece to bring it home? Yes. They can reach out to Jeremy through any of his social media pages, Rivers Edge Gallery, Art at the Edge. That is the name of this project, and you can find him on social media. You can also ask one of these store owners how to get in touch with him, and soon there will be more signage to give you further direction. But reach out to him directly. All of this work is for sale.